The Florida Current, an online news service smartly covering politics and policy. Subscribe for free daily alerts at thefloridacurrent.com. Citizens' top managers were accused of spending like drunken sailors on trips and conferences. Governor Rick Scott ordered his inspector general to take a look. So that we could find a watchdog for citizens that would help bring integrity, accountability, and honesty. Once the abuses were uncovered, Governor Rick Scott started calling for an inspector general after reports of sexual harassment and financial irregularities at the state's largest insured. The new government watchdog was named Tuesday by the governor and the cabinet. A 30-year veteran of state government, Bruce Meeks will become the first citizen's inspector general. Meeks was not at the meeting. All in favor of selecting Mr. Meeks, please say aye. 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 All opposed, please say nay. The ayes have it. Meeks will report to the chairman of the board for citizens on day-to-day -day operations. He can only be removed from his position by the governor and the cabinet. The inspector general is going to hold citizens accountable. Uh, I proposed this earlier this year, and I'm glad the legislature went along with it. But look, we, we've got to have citizens held accountable. We've got to watch how they spend the money. 88 people applied for the position. 12 were interviewed. The newly created position was authorized by the legislature during the 2013 session. In Tallahassee, I'm Matt Horn reporting.